such an experience in your life that the, uh, that the goalkeeper scores such a goal? Mm, to be honest, no. <laughs> Directly is the first is the first time that uh, this happened to to us. Um, of course, it was a lucky goal, but it was it, it's it's um, it's something that is not uh, is not just by chance. We have this way of going out because we know also that Chancha have a very good a very good kick. Uh, in fact, we wanted to play with the wind in the first half, <laughs> but we lost the draw. But uh, today the wind stayed. Don't go. So the wind stayed for us. And uh, yeah, this can happen. This is uh, this is football. And when you have the round ball, anything can happen. Yeah, it was a, it's a very difficult match. Uh, the score looks easy, but it's a very difficult match. Um, both teams uh, want to want to win. We know that we are playing against a very good team. I don't know what you want me to stop or to if you want to stop, I will stop. Uh, so, um, if you look at the facts of the statistics of the game, you see it was a very even match. Of course, we, uh, the Ajax is a very strong team, as I said. But uh, this today was uh, winning from uh, the group because the, the players believed they could, they could win. They worked very hard. I didn't like too much our first half because we, don't, we couldn't keep the ball as much as I would like to, them to do. But uh, defensively, the guys gave everything. They tried. Uh, we, we took a goal from a situation that we knew they are dangerous. Uh, they are very physical. They, are, they have good guys to take set pieces also. We tried to prepare the best for this. And unfortunately, we took one goal. But after, I think the team reacted very well. Um, we, it was very important for us to score still in the first in the first half, and I was very for this. I was very very happy because it was something that we we worked on to to try to get this goal, and uh, we got it. And then in the second half, I think we 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 were better. We were controlling more the ball. We don't let Ajax to get so many situations in the into scoring zones. So the boys did a very good job. And then of course we had this uh, situation of Chanta, and then again from Gregorio. This is, this is football, this is work, and uh, again, I am very happy for my boys because they put everything on the field and they, today they took, uh, they took this, this win. But but of course it's uh, still the first half we have the second half in one week in uh, Ajax so you know this is a very strong team my boys and me and all the staff will do our best to go there and to to try to, to make it again happen.
But goals are scoring, Gregory. Why you? Um, what is the reason that you uh, trust Ayas so much? I trust them both. His strategy. Sometimes we'll play one, sometimes we'll play the other, sometimes they'll play the both. I have the same trust in both of them. Uh, what is his strongest? Uh, what is Ayas's the strongest points, uh, characteristics uh, that you uh, that you play him? He's a very mobile player. He's a fast player. He has a good situation within between the lines. Also, he's fast in the back of the of the of the of the um, center backs. So he's a different character. This is why we bring him. We have two different quality players in our team. And as I said again. It's a strategy. I have plenty of confidence on the two. And when we want to use one, we will. Also, the timings of the game, you have to understand that uh, the game is not won since the first minute. So there are strategies that we have planned during the, the game. So. Uh, Thank you. Um, what can I say? It's their character. It's their personality. They are hungry to win. And so just because they are one goal behind, they, they, they know that they cannot stop. It's, it's, it's like this. You, have, you took one hit, you have to react. And I think the team reacted very well to this. And uh, this is their personality. And this is why I say I'm so happy for my boys, because they believe since the first minute that they could win today. The journalist is saying that as far as we are not that acquainted with your style, uh, it, it, it happens that Noah has two goals, is two goals ahead of uh, the opponent. What will you do? Is it possible that in the next match you uh, decide not to play this kind of aggressive, uh, uh, aggressive uh, game, not being aggressive in the, in the scoring? No, this doesn't uh, fit my character. This doesn't fit my character. Uh, you know that uh, if you are going there only to defend, <laughs> you are playing with such quality players that they have. If you are only coming down and try to, to, to do this result, uh, for me, this doesn't, doesn't work out. So we will analyze the game, of course. We, are know, we know that we are going to the second half with 2-0, but also we know we are playing against a very good team 
uh, with very quality players. So we need to be on our best shape to to win this uh, this uh, elimination round. <laughs> No one has considered two goals during this European uh, games and both goals were from up to the corner. Do you see a problem here? We took two goals, uh, but uh, if we see maybe the, the efficiency of so how many corners we take and uh, the situation, okay, maybe it's not such a high percentage. It's something that we work, it's something that we give a lot of, of analyzing also with my staff, takes this very seriously. The boys not too know, but sometimes, you know, it's, it's also the merit from the, from the, from the opponent. So uh, we are playing against good teams with good players, sometimes it can happen. But it's something that we take very seriously, and uh, as I said, maybe the percentage, after all, is not so low as it seems, but it's a fact we took two goals from set pieces. Yeah, Granik is um, is a part of this team. He's uh, working hard. He's developing also. He's a very uh, unique player. Um, as I as I see him, he have a very good quality relationship with the ball. His uh, evolution in tactically is getting better and better. And uh, we felt this was the right choice because he's very aggressive. He works a lot. He's a very good kid. So I'm very happy for him also that we, he could help the team. No, because he's a, a very aggressive, you know, he put everything in the game, so it, we needed this at the time of that we that he go. This stadium have, helps Noah a lot, the fans help Noah a lot. What will happen if you will have to play in the public stadium if, if the fans were, are not there? We have to play. We would like here to play because for for us it's it's all, of course the support of the player of the of the of our fans is, is fantastic and I want to I want to thank them again for, for being there with us because as I said to you many times they are our 12th player playing it uh, with us um, but mostly also the quality of our pitch I think in this stage that other teams also are playing in the Republic Stadium. It's it's better that you know that we can make a, a better management of the of the of the field because with so many teams playing there, then it started to not get so so good and we need good pitches to play good football. No, because we can like because there's too many. No, for the fans, it's for for us is is important of course, to have our friends with us, but also because of the, f the, the quality of the field, because there are many teams playing in the Republican Stadium. Uh, 
Նշում է, որ մարդ է լերի հարկի որ այստեղ խաղանք, որով հետեք եկ պատներ այստեղ մեզ հետ են, նրանք պանտաստիկ են, շտարական են նրանց համար, ինչպես շատ է հաճախասիլ են, նրանք տասեղկույերով � Okay. Okay. Thank you. Good night.